In Lackawanna, where the push is on to get a grocery store. The closest one is a few miles away, and many say it's a hardship for people in that low income neighborhood to get there. News Force Chris Hervatitz is looking into the effort to change that. Chris? Well, State Senator Tim Kennedy agrees that particular neighborhood just isn't served adequately enough. He's now written to executives of several grocery stores, including Price Right, Aldi's, and Price Chopper, asking them to set up shop in Lackawanna's first ward. It's a problem with everyone around here, and it, you know things have to open up with voices. You know, no voices, nothing gets done, nothing gets taken care of. Thomas Mathis has lived here his whole life. Christopher Bradley has been here a long time too. Lackawanna's first ward covers the western part of the city. It's served by several corner marts, but no large-scale grocery stores. The closest one of those is the Save a Lot on Abbott Road, two miles away. You have to outsource maybe the Save a Lot tops or Wegmans, but it's not primarily in a neighborhood where we can go for like healthier groceries and stuff like that. Probably you have to commute, cab, bus line. Usually, uh, that should be the best option, either the bus or a cab. State Senator Tim Kennedy has taken notice. In the letter he sent to several grocery store executives, Kennedy wrote the area of Lackawanna west of South Park Avenue qualifies as both a low-income and low-access food desert. These areas rely heavily on small corner stores that primarily provide processed, unhealthy foods that are known contributors to our nation's obesity epidemic. The USDA defines a food desert as a low-income neighborhood that doesn't have access to healthy food. Bradley is thinking big picture. He thinks a grocery store in the neighborhood could mean much more than just better nutrition. Job opportunity. You feel me? It'll be an enthusiasm that there was something like that finally facilitating in their neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? So I would think like job opportunity. It definitely would be easier access for the elders. You know, at the end of the day, everybody shares the same values and the same principles around here. But, you know, we're only as good as our resources that we have around us. While Senator Kennedy waits for a response from those grocery stores, a community food garden has been planted at Mount Olive Baptist Church on Wasson Street. Residents in Lackawanna's first ward will have access to healthy foods grown there. Chris Horvath, it's News 4.